When I'm older, I'd like to be a plumber and an electrician because that's what my dad is. Really? When I'm older, I'd like to be, be a rugby player, really, because that's what my dad does and my brother does as well. When I grow up, I want, I'd like to be a policeman or a post office and follow my dad's career. When I grow up, I want to be a professional rugby player. I want to be an entrepreneur when I'm older and things like that. I want to be a hairdresser. Yeah, I'd like to be a businesswoman when I'm older. When I'm older, I want to own my own business and run a nursery. When I'm older, I'd like to be a designer for the interior and exterior of cars. I want to be a rugby player, like internationally, or um, farming. When I leave school, I really want to be like an actress or do something in performing arts, like soap star. Uh, when I leave school, um, I want to go into business school, I think. Uh, when I leave school, I want to become an athlete and I want to be a medalist and I want to take part in the 2012 Olympics, hopefully. Well, I'd like to be a show, an Olympic show jumper. I'd stay in Kent, but I'll just have to keep moving around to do it. I'd probably stay in Kent, yeah. Yeah, Kent's a good place. I don't mind living there. I really want to be on EastEnders. <laughs> I think that'd be fun to do. So I'd probably have to move up to London or something. Uh, anyway, everybody needs a plumber and electrician, so I don't mind where I go really. It's our hometown. Like we've lived in it like for ages. I think I'd have to move away to some area, but because I don't think I could get that sort of job in where I'm living. It is a nice area, but it's not like um, a business sort of area. It's not well built up for that sort of thing. Maybe if there was more facilities for that sort of job and more better jobs and a better way of life sort of thing. I would probably move to, I don't know about London, because I think it's a bit busy for, to work with children, but I would probably just stay around in Maidstone or Kent. I would like to go to America with some of my cousins and go out there for a bit. No, I think I'm going to move like just around probably to Wales or something. That's where I'm originally from. But because I've got more rugby opportunities in Wales, so and it's going to be and I've got more, all my family there to help. It's going to be easier for me to move. Move away, probably. Yeah, maybe you would have to move away, but I wouldn't. I wouldn't like move out of Kent. We learned like not to give up even if you fail. And not like, to mess up the interview. Yeah. <laughs> and learn from our mistakes. Yeah. I actually really enjoyed today. I've loved it. It's, it's fun. Just, <laughs> it's, it's a lot of fun and it's just teaching us a lot and that. Yeah, they were yeah. useful. It's they just taught us new giving stuff. Giving us so much ideas. Um, we did brand new. That was quite good. And the creativity and innovation one. That was. <laughs> yeah, I fell down. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, the I think the creation one was better because you can interact on the brand new. It's good but he just talks to you, so you can't really do as much. Um yeah, I just do think they help because I don't know, it's just different ideas of how to, to piece together what you want to do. Um, and make it easier and better. I think they help me just they'll help me decide what I wanna do after I after I've retired from being an athlete, so I'll like, think of a job after that. Yeah, there's a lot more options as well with these things. It like widens your views and things. And they can help you to choose what you want to do when you grow up and that, so. Uh, the first one she was talking about, uh, how you set up your own business and things like that. That was quite interesting and she talked about the money and the things that you can get out of it. And that was good. The second one was about like uh, leadership and management, the differences between it. So it's quite interesting to know what's the difference between being a leader, and being a manager. Yeah, they've given me like my choice and my idea of what I can do. It's been good. I liked the um, be your own boss part. That was good. The way that um, that I found out how to sort of succeed in a business. So that was good.
I think that I'd like to see more kind, more things to do, so more like shopping places and fun things to do. It is a nice area, but it's not like um, a business sort of area. It's not well built up for that sort of thing. Maybe if there was more facilities for that sort of job and more better jobs and a better way of life sort of thing. Um, more facilities for like our, our age group, like 13 year olds upwards. More things so that we can keep off the streets and keep out of trouble. Mm. Same really, so we don't get into trouble with the police and we've got more things to do so we don't get bored so easily. Um, the way it looks. Like, I think Dover just looks rubbish. And folks, I come from Folkestone anyway, but I think Folkestone looks a lot, lot nicer than Dover. Yeah, same. Dover's like really plain and stuff. Um, like different businesses and different choices to make and different jobs. Um, the one thing I'd like to improve in Kent is like, I would like it to be cleaner because there's there's so, always so much rubbish around and everything. It's just not kept that much, that tidy. Yeah.